Hi, this is Dr. Renat for the Spine Institute, and we're performing today a procedure called radiofrequency ablation of the genicular nerves. And that procedure is done for the knee pain that is resistant to multiple treatment modalities for severe degeneration, and the patient is not a good candidate for knee surgery, as well as any patient who had knee surgery and still complaining of pain in the knee. Now, those patients who do a diagnostic block first, where we numb the genicular nerves, and see if they get good relief or not. If they get relief at least 50% or above, that means that they are a good candidate for the radiofrequency ablation. So this patient, he had good response to the diagnostic block and today we're performing the radiofrequency ablation. There are three nerves, the superior medial, superior lateral, and inferior medial genicular nerves that we're going to ablate today. So we localize the uh, nerves under X-ray. So we localize the nerves and then insert the needle. Then we advance it. Take a picture. We advance the uh, needle until the uh, appropriate position where the genital nerve is. So first we take AP projection uh, x-rays and then we take a lateral x-ray for proper localization of the tip of the needle. Now patient slightly sedated. Now we have the needle tip exactly where we want it, around the uh, genicular nerves. Then we're going to do now sens uh, sensory and motor testing uh, to make sure we're testing the right nerves. And after that, we're going to numb the nerves before uh, doing the radiofrequency lesioning or cauterization. Okay, perfect. So now we're doing stimulation and we're not getting any motor stimulation. So after uh, numbing the uh, nerves, then we wait about 30 seconds to a minute until the nerve is numb and then we uh, we're going to perform radio frequency lesioning right now. Okay. Okay, and then now we're done. We're just gonna be pulling the needle out. Patient already proceeded very well. Thank you.